There we go. Hi, we're here with Darren Rouse from Pro Blogger. Hi, Darren. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for taking a few minutes to talk with me. Um, hey, I just wanted to, I mean, you're a busy guy. You've got two blogs. You've now got two children yep. also, very little. And you work from home, yep. right, which most a lot of our readers do in Spark Plugging. And I just wondered if you could tell us a couple questions. One is what's your kind of biggest productivity killer and what do you do to get over it? Look, there's lots. Of, uh, <laughs> <laughs> apart from children, um, one right. of whom has just discovered how to open doors. Um, so that <laughs> closed door policy that I used to have doesn't so work so well <laughs> these days. Probably the biggest one is just the interruptions from readers um, and from the web. Mm. Uh, I, I see them some days as interruptions and some days as opportunities. And so right. it's, for me, it's about... Um, defining boundaries for when to do certain activities and when to be available to readers of, of my blogs. And so instant messaging, looking at Twitter, any of those types of things can potentially be distractions, but they can also bring a lot of life to the business that I run. So yeah, it's about setting up walls and barriers and switching off right. instant messaging and, and those types of things. And actually sitting down at the start of the day and working out what I want to achieve mm -hmm. and blocking out times to do that and yeah, making opportunities to be accessible as well. Minimizing those distractions, yeah. even when you love them dearly, right? Yeah. <laughs> um, so what do you think would be your biggest advice for someone who is working from home? Maybe they're just getting started um, and they have you know, kids at home or what have you. Yeah. Working from home, what's your best advice? Um, probably the best time for me is when I get out of the house. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm lucky enough to have a, a notebook, a laptop, and so I have mobile internet. That was mm -hmm. something that I, uh, has helped me a lot. And so I'll hit a cafe and quite often two mornings a week, I'll spend at least four or five hours in one or two different cafes and just batching out that time just to write or to do those priority mm -hmm. activities. And so, yeah, it's about, it's another, I guess, removing yourself from the distractions right. and then setting aside quality time for the children so that they don't feel starved with you when you are home. So right. yeah, again, it's probably about boundaries. Um, and also, I guess the other thing I do is batch process, um, which is setting aside time for certain things rather than checking email every five minutes. Mm -hmm. I set aside an hour to do that at a certain time of the day. And the same with writing my blog, same with, answering emails, all those sorts of things, they all have a, a slot in the day rather than running from one thing frantically to another. Right, having a little ADD yeah. thing running around. Yeah. Which yeah. my personality type actually suits, like I like that type of thing, mm -hmm. but I get a lot less done when I do it. So it's kind of, right. yeah, reacting against who I am, but it actually helps me a lot. Gotcha. Great, and how can people find you? Problogger.net or on Twitter, Problogger. Awesome. Thanks, Darren. Thanks.